Good afternoon. Good afternoon, ma'am. What is your name? My name is Marian Morandiosa. Marian, how old are you? I'm 37 years old. Single or married? Married. With how many kids do you have? I have two kids. How old are they? Uh, 8 years old and 11 years old. Your husband is working in the gasoline station? Yes, ma'am. You worked before in Hong Kong? Yes, ma'am. In what year? Uh, 2004 and 2006. During those period 2004 and 2006, you are still single on that time? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So, you worked for two years. And after that? I go back to the Philippines, ma'am. Why? I get married. You got married. And you got your two kids now, yes, right? Yes, mm. Where in Hong Kong you worked before? Maonshan Territories. How big is the house? Uh, one story house, ma'am. One story. Two rooms, yes, something like that. Mm. How many members of the family? Uh, only four, ma'am. Couple? Uh, one madam, one sir, and two kids. Two kids. How old are the kids? Uh, eight years old and 14 years old. <coughs> girls or boys? The same girls. Okay. What are your duties with these uh, kids before? Uh, in the morning? Uh, I wake up her mom, then... You mean you wake up the kids? Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. And then? And then... I... Do you prepare I breakfast? I prepare the food for, for them, then... Mm -hmm. After that, I send, I send her in the shuttle bus. Just on day. And then I go back to the house, and I do my responsibilities. Do you go market? Yes, ma'am. Sometimes. Would you like to tell me some vegetable you know? Uh, choy sam. Choy sam. Uh, choy sam. What else? Mm. Sawyok. Uh, only only choy sam, ma. <laughs> no. But are you the one who goes to market before? Yes, ma'am. I only went. They give you the money and then you budget the money? Yes, ma'am. How often they give you one week budget or everyday budget? No, no, ma'am. Just only in one day. Enough for one day? Yes, ma'am. Mm. Do you have grandmother at home before? Uh, yes, ma'am, but she only visit. Well, visit only. I see. Um, you told me before that your employer is nurse. Yes, and your day off is international day off. It means uh, it's a flexible day off. Yes, ma'am. So you are very familiar that Chinese people really sometimes they give a flexible day off. Yes, ma'am. What matters that you have day off, right? Yes, ma'am. You don't mind if not Saturday or Sunday. Yes, ma'am. Sometimes they buy your day off. You will not go for day off and then they give you money. Yes, ma'am. You choose what? You, you, you give money or you have the day off? Uh, I keep the money. <laughs> <laughs> Why? I need I need the money ma because, because you need money. the money okay since you stayed in Hong Kong so it means to say you are familiar or you have some idea of Chinese culture right yes ma'am and you know that Chinese people they are very demanding yes ma'am they like eating yes ma'am and also um the house in in um Hong Kong is small yes ma'am and there, there is a big chance that you will share room with other members of the family. You know that, right? Yes, ma'am. Mm. Okay. You stayed in Hong Kong. Did you learn Cantonese? Uh, a little bit, ma'am. A simple Cantonese. Would you mind to tell me what are those Cantonese you know? Why say pigo ya? Hi. How you greet Bopo in the morning? Uh? Bopo, chow san. Chow san. And then what else? Uh? Why? Papa, yeah, pangawa. Pangawa, hi la. And then? Sikpana. Mmm, sikpana. Chungya mo ah. Meron pa? Ay, is there, there are some more? Yes, ma'am. What else? When you answer the phone, what you say? Way. Way? Okay. When they say you come, how could you say that? Um, go lai. Go lai, yeah. Hi. Um, how about take a bath? Chong leung ah. Chong leung ah. Hi, okay. That's the only thing you learned before as Cantonese? No, I'm quite chat chat. 
唔该姐姐 ，OK <laughs>。But are you willing to learn? So it means to say you have I you have some idea why you need to speak Cantonese, right? Yes, ma'am. Because you need that to communicate with grandmother, yes, or maybe the employer don't know how to speak fluently English. Yes. So do you think you have the heart to learn more? Yes, ma'am. Hmm. So, um, as I've seen in your bio data. You work in new territory, so if you've given a chance and you work in Taipo, I mean very far, yes, the last station also in Funling, <laughs> you don't mind? Yes. So you don't choose the the location. No, ma'am. Very good. You don't choose also the the um, the day off. No, ma'am. Are you afraid of dog? Um, Just no. tell me honestly. No. No. How about cats? No, but I don't like animals. Oh, you don't. You are not pet lover, yes. but you are not afraid of them. Yes, oh, that's good. No problem. Okay. Do you think you can get easy to get along well with the old people? Yes. Okay. So you have some idea of their mentality, yes, of their behavior. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> so would you mind to describe one to ten? What is the level of your patience? Ten, mom. Ten. Yes, mom. Ten. Wow. I have a lot of patience. Patience. That's good. Do you love cooking? Yes, mom. Very much. That's your. That's your skill. Yes, mom. Hmm. I see. Okay. Tell me your message to your future employer. Uh, hello, mom. I hope you like me. If I be there. And then what else? Uh, Any promise you can say to your employer? I promise I do my best to like me, and I hope you are so very kind to me. <laughs> That's all. Yes, ma'am. Okay, thank you. Thank you. See you in Hong Kong. Yes, ma'am. Bye bye. Yeah.